What is up, y'all? Welcome to another Epic 7 stream. It's your boy, Mashu. How's it going, guys? It's player top 16. <laughs> Friendly new. Bringing you awesome. new news today. Well, hello, everyone. Welcome to another patch preview where we go over the upcoming patch notes uh, alongside our Korean stream. So if we are delayed, you guys know the gist of it. Um, we are following a script from the, the other side with small details in between so please be wary that we might be you know chugging along on some things and as you guys know at the start of all these update streams i always give you guys like a rating on what i think of today's preview i would say today's um the beginning is i think like a, a six out of ten and then towards the end maybe like a seven out of ten in terms of hype so yeah, yeah. Yeah, so we'll see what happens. Uh, but first off, everyone already, yeah, you guys already know it. The survey is up now, guys. Go ahead and check it out, exclamation point, survey in chat. Get your three leaves and 300k gold for YouTube. I'll be pinning that link to the top. I believe I did already. So hopefully, it happened. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Someone in chat just said tautology. I used that <laughs> word recently, and everyone's like, what does that even mean? <laughs> But yes, guys, we'll be going over a lot of stuff, a lot of changes in general. But the first change that we'll be going over is the March balance adjustments, right? So DJB, oh, Shu, Carmen, uh, Broman, not Broman, so it's Trozet, um, Kawana, SC Helga. And it's actually our first time changing, uh, like an actual Sagittarius, like the, what do you call oh. it now? What do you guys call it? The the signs. Yeah, yeah, constellations. Yeah. <laughs> constellations. <laughs> um yeah, so DJ Bissar, potentially another addition to the Golden Boy Club. Potentially. Potentially. He seems pretty interesting. Uh yeah. extra healing. Okay, let me pull up this. Yeah, so increased healing on that effect and the thirty oh yeah, the thirty percent damage reduction pretty big when it's on uh not on cool or yeah when it's up yeah. so i have a question for uh you guys in chat how are you guys liking um ml a little bit recently the reason why i bring this up because it's because dj basar is another potential counter to debuffs mm -hmm. so yeah not all best waifu okay he's bad Needs let buff. Me, let me just say, guys, I'm really sorry for hyping her up. <laughs> Dude, you were wrong twice so far, oh, right? She looks, she looks good. She looks right? really good. She, she has a good. cat. That's she the reason why you guys pulled for her, right? Desi Bat. Dude, I think the, the hardest thing right now uh, about designer a little bit is people trying to figure out what to actually like nickname her, right? There's Deli <laughs> Bat. Yeah. There's Dilibet, Dilbert, I heard some people say. Yeah. Hold her for the cat. Okay. But yeah, Shu, yeah. also another big contender, right? For those of you guys who didn't pull for her, who knows maybe the next Mystic Rotation might be more interesting? Maybe. Hint, hint, something that hasn't been announced yet, but will be announced. In the future, or well, in later in the stream, for sure. Later in the stream, yeah. But another person contender, uh, Shu. So shoot coming out with uh, more focus gain and uh, more penetration of defense, right? I think, I don't, I don't think, personally, I don't think um, this meta is the right meta for Shu, despite the buffs, but we'll, we'll, we'll see. Maybe people will pop off with their shoes. Yeah. Get out of here. And the other is Carmen, another big one that people have been talking about. But we'll be moving on into now um the other change that'll be coming out this patch it is the book of memories so guys if you guys are wondering uh from last time of how the book of memories will work we have it right here so oh. the two current ones you'll have is the rain guards chaotic full moon and the shadow of ravenwing manor hmm. two big ones that people ask for especially for like one for cirilla chatty you get as well oh when you said two big ones i was thinking of something else there you go. That's what I was thinking of. Two big ones. Two big ones. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> but yeah, so you guys are able to get uh, Cirilla within the um, Book of Memories. And Rain Garth's Chaotic will go after as well. Uh, more increase your chance, Chatty as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. People are uh, noticing regarding the 900 Sky Stones I'll be taken um, for this. Yeah, it's it's pricey in effect, but people want it if it's there. Uh, if then we'll see what we can do about people talking about lowering that cost. So hopefully. And we have Rain Guards, Chaotic, Full Moon Festival, as you see here. You get all of the nice things in there. Kicker Rat. Obviously, everyone wants Kicker Rat, right? <laughs> but mostly Midnight Bloom, I feel. Midnight yeah. Bloom is good to have. Yeah. When you're missing I, that extra I, crit. I feel like everyone in chat, though, are long-time hardcore players, though. So... Most of you guys probably have all this. Whoa, right? whoa, dude, dude, you're talking. This is the first time I think I've seen you like actually compliment them for being like longtime hardcore players. Has Just there been you another time? For a long time doesn't mean that you're good at it, you know. <laughs> and and uh, we have new back at it again, guys. But yeah, alongside this book of memories, it just shows like uh, uh, the timeline as well of all these stories that we'll be going through. And then just everything that you'll be able to get through each story. So maybe we'll be able to release some other side stories in the future that people may want into the Book of Memories. But yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, how do you feel about the new feature now? Being able to go back to old side stories? I think there's there's like a lot of people, you know, the um, high cost. Mm -hmm. Really determining if it's worth it or not. And... I don't know. Maybe if we get a lot more of that feedback, we could potentially see adjustments to that. But yeah, let us know if you guys feel that as a new person who hasn't had a chance to do this part of the side story, if that cost is worth it for the potential prizes. Yeah, for the people that want it, especially, right? Yeah. So if anything, uh, like if it's too much or maybe we need to buff like the rewards in it, uh, stuff like that, let us know. Um, Discord's always there for suggestions. We always check everything out. Especially if you guys uh, are on um, other social medias as well, our Instagram, our Facebook, uh, other people's Twitch channels. I'm always lurking around. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Everyone's saying it's too high. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's too high. I think that, that notion, though, is because of what they're getting, right? So, honestly, it might be, like, better. Maybe if, like, we add more rewards to it, would you say it's more worth it? I don't know. People are saying maybe like 500. That's also reasonable too. But yes, guys, that's for the book of memories. The options there. You don't have to do it. Yeah, you don't have to do it if you guys already have it and you already have everything that's in it. I mean, unless you want to play back the story. But honestly, I don't know. Those stories are pretty nice. Do it for this. Do it for the story. Don't do it for the rewards. <laughs> do it for the story. Exactly. All the lore heads that are missing. That little piece of lore is just right there, dude. Mm -hmm. Oh, people are, yeah, back to buffs, though. So, dude, which one, which one, well, I mean, do any of these change anything that you do? <laughs> no. No. Come on, dude. No. I know a bunch really. of people who built Shu and are ready to go, to be honest. It's like they're gonna check out and see if she's good or not. I mean, here's the thing: if if you pick Shu, you are hundred percent forced to pick Landy. You know, mm. you have to pick Landy if you pick Shu. Otherwise, you just get countered. If you pick Shu and your oh. opponent takes Landy, then you're already so forced early in yeah. the draft phase to force ban the Landy, and that's just like it's a really scary. bad situation to be in. Countered, not as in like counter like the set guys. Don't worry. Yeah. But or next can, up, yeah. though. We'll be talking about the World Arena Ardor Season, guys. The biggest thing that will be coming out soon. Guys, make sure, okay? Make sure to, to get into masses while you still can. This thing ends on 3.18 at 3 a.m. UTC time. As for what time that is for us, I have no idea at the top of my head. Remember what I said, guys. Remember what I said. You know, if you go into World Arena, 
with that mentality that, you know, there will always be someone better than you, then you've already lost, okay? Go into World Arena with the mentality there is always someone worse than you. I've seen the subreddit, okay? And there are a lot of people posting on the subreddit in Epic 7. There are 30, 20% win rates, and they've made it faster. Really and, and using, like, really weird comps, right? Like, only RGBs or or yeah. only, like, without even limiteds, no limiteds or anything else such like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's possible. Literally. I believe in you guys. You guys got this. And if not, if not, then I mean, like, for those of you who are newer to the game, the uh, the currency, right? The conquest points that you get are nothing to joke about either. Wait, 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 Mashu. There's people what? in chat saying, wait, News being nice? Is he sick? <laughs> I'm not being nice, guys. But he I is have, sick. I have low expectations of you guys. <laughs> That's why I'm telling you guys that there's people with 30% win rate that made it into Master. And I know majority of people, you in chat, are probably going to be in that group that have like a 30% win rate. Hey, hey, but, but they're master. But they're master. And that's all that matters, guys. And speaking of another skin, the Dark Tyrant Spectre Tenebria skin will not be going on sale in the store for 110 uh, skin tickets. You guys will be able to get it there for those of you who missed out on this skin before. So, yeah, you guys will get the nice. I, I said this last time. I said this last time, but the fact that there are so many people in chat like say yes, it's finally there. That I just know. shows me. That no, we have a lot of like. Wait, what? I, I know a lot of people who missed it. But another thing too, uh, to go into World Arena, guys, we are making some changes to the lobby for better. Um, right here is a video on the newest way uh, to interact with the lobbies of uh, World Arena that'll be introduced soon. It's the number of pre-banned heroes, okay? So you can able you're able now to choose zero, one, two, or three pre-bans uh for lobbies. So yeah. For those of you who are making content or wanna want more things to ban to get more like variety in choices, there you go. That's like six bands, dude, the total. This that is like is pretty crazy. Marshall, when we do our like weekly streams where we do lobbies, yeah. This is actually really bad for us. Because I already, dude, limit, I already I, limit myself by never picking any dude characters. Me too. So now that people, like, they know what I use, you can just target three ban me. It's going to be so hard. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, this pre banning method for our streams, and if we end up in implementing it in our battles, dude, yeah. what are we going to choose? Yeah. I mean, this doesn't really hurt people who are nobodies, right? <laughs> Cause, monster because you don't have to you can't like target pre-band <laughs> yeah just do generic triple bands but yeah guys this is the test so don't worry uh, it will be implemented within the next patch so be prepared for that um like i said skin before moving on along as well we have a rate up for charles guys so rate up for charles incoming Make sure to grab him if you guys want him. Justice for all. Pretty good artifact overall. That's a that's a Clurry artifact. Yeah, it's a Clurry artifact. <laughs> that's, that's not a Charles artifact. De decent Charlotte artifact too. Decent Charlotte artifacts. I think Charlotte's really good. I don't see enough Charlottes. I guess most people opt to go Ravi instead of Charlotte. Yeah, pretty much for sure lately, like, Ravi's been a menace to everywhere. And I know here and now is we're going to be going on to the next topic that was teased earlier. And it is the Rima oh. specialty change, guys. So here's Rima. Check her out. The music you've been waiting for. Let me perform it for you. All right. How inspiring. Shimbianimagazin, 
희망의 찬가로 강화됩니다. 이제 자신을 제외한 아군 한 명의 스킬 쿨타임을 3턴 감소시킬 뿐만 아니라 대상에게 2턴간 공격력 증가를 발생시킵니다. 먼저 능력치를 증가시키는 룬입니다. 건강의 룬 생명력이 최대 10% 증가합니다. 성물의 룬 효과적 중이 최대 25% 증가합니다. 번영의 룬 아군 전체의 효과적 중을 최대 5% 증가시킵니다. 신앙의 룬 협공 확률이 최대 2% 증가합니다. 다음은 스킬과 관련된 룬입니다. 수호의 룬 1스킬 재빠른 사격의 피해량이 최대 5% 증가합니다. 희생의 룬 재빠른 사격 사용 시 최대 75% 확률로 대상에게 1턴간 속도 감소를 발생시킵니다. 고독의 룬 재빠른 사격 사용 시 아군 전체가 냉기 속성이라면 최대 100% 확률로 가장 공격력 높은 아군의 행동 게이지를 5% 증가시킵니다. 질서의 룬 2스킬 자전거 화살 사용 시 아군 전체가 냉기 속성이라면 최대 100% 확률로 대상에게 2턴간 방어력 감소를 발생시킵니다. 관대의 룬 자전거 화살 사용 시 치명타가 발생했다면 최대 100% 확률로 대상의 행동 게이지를 10% 감소시킵니다. 수학의 룬 3스킬 희망의 창가 사용 시 아군 전체가 냉기 속성이라면 최대 100% 확률로 대상에게 2턴간 속도 증가를 발생시킵니다. 영혼을 노래하는 천재 뮤지션 리마 50레벨을 달성해 전직하게 되면 만나실 수 있습니다. 고맙습니다. And there you guys have it. Here is Muse Rima, guys. The, 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 the biggest thing that I'm taking away from this by looking at chat is that y'all don't even read their description or even know who this is. Yes, Rima is a girl. And yes, now she's a maid. <laughs> new? <laughs> People are wondering when you're going to cosplay her, New. Wait, wait, what? Wait, wait. You guys are wondering when I'm going to cosplay her? Guys, look at me. I am perhaps the most masculine looking dude ever. There is no way I can pull that cosplay off. There's no way. But yeah, Rima's a girl. But yes, guys, alongside her war him now turns into a hopeful him, increasing attack for two turns after reducing the cooldown of her unit by three turns. Uh, you guys can check out her runes here. Health increase, effectiveness <laughs> increase, more effectiveness increase. <laughs> People are saying you looks like a girl. I'm going to keep on moving on, guys. The faith oh rune increases God. dual attack chance. 7% dual attack chance now. Holy crap. A uh, quick shot increases damage dealt. Uh, this one's not as good. Um, but the decreased speed is nice. And the death break is nice as well. Yeah. Which we have right. Not this one. So I know, there was, nice? I know there was a lot of people who were really concerned that Rima would be like Katie's, you know? Like Katie's hunt. For sure, dude. Yeah, That's... Or, or Golem. Or Golem hunts. People now, coming like, to me on Discord yeah. straight up like, please yeah. don't be Katie's hunts. Please don't be Katie's hunts. But yeah, look at this. This is like yeah. Wyvern. And Wyvern, Wyvern and Expo. So I mean, yeah. to help people out. For both sides, building a unit that's universal for for yeah. both as a, a ice unit, right? That's literally like 99% of the game, right? Wyvern. So she's usable in like the biggest, the biggest and aspect. And the expo the for Wyvern, dude. Yeah. Uh, ice almost, yeah, it, the chance to decrease defense is pretty nice. 100%, guys. 100%. So oh, good. Okay, true. She's not like the most optimal hero for wyvern but it can work true <laughs> good for like mashi said expedition yeah expedition yeah hopeful him guys uh increased speed at 100 percent chance for the target increased speed is nice trying to get that uh more use off of that attack buff that you're giving them and yeah <laughs> alongside that guys you guys are able to check her out here obtainable via specialty change with level 50 rima clear episode three two 
S3 Suspicious Alley. Mm. Um, I don't think it's all that bad, right? It's pretty easy to farm overall. Uh, you'll be able to do this just going alongside your your regular adventures and whatnot. What's up, new? Here's the thing. At least it's not like I know there was a lot of people saying Rima. Like what? Rima? Like really ran? Like what? At least it wasn't Jenna, right? <laughs> you guys and Jenna, dude. She exists. I swear. Who the hell is Jenna? <laughs> okay. You monsters. Yeah, guys. Rima is really helpful for. Um, the Brutal Ferris, which is an expo to help alongside that. We also have uh, news for expo stuff at the end of the stream, so please stay tuned for that notice. But yeah, honestly okay. speaking, though, New, how do you feel like for this uh, specialty change compared to the other specialty change units? Like, okay, okay, visually, I mean, visually, okay, visually first, visually first, visually, yeah. I say, you and you guys know how I feel about short hair, you guys know, but. Reverse trap, kind of cool. You know, kinda it's not cool. the generic trap kind of like, archetype. You see that so much, but the reverse trap is kind of a lot, lot more rare, I think. Mm -hmm. So, seven out of ten for a, appearance. Seven Just out average, of ten. Average. Close. Yeah. Uh, kit wise, for a specialty change, better than Carmen Rose. There you go. Better than Carmen, you monster. But yes, guys, moving on along now, guys, we're going to be going up to the raid ups for uh, this this coming week. So not this week, but the the week after. We have a raid up for Tammy. So for those of you who are new to the game, who are or those of you who are in trouble with PVE, y'all need to get on this banner like instantly. This is probably the best banner for any newer player or people who are struggling with PvE in general. Did you guys know that to this day I don't have Tamarin? Never used Tamarin. Have you pulled I her? Never even bothered to pull for Tamarin. No, but have you pulled her before? Like like if a Tamarin showed up, like it's not new, right? No, I've never pulled her either. The, press exit down. We'll check that on Thursday, guys. Yeah, no, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> and as well, guys, for those of you who need more immunity, we have the drop rate up for Vivian along with Dignus Orb. Dignus Orb being a pretty interesting uh, artifact. It is used sometimes, but there also is other artifacts. It's a mage artifact, right? Yeah. But Vivian overall is being used. <laughs> People are like, oh, dude. But compared to Tama, dude, honestly, get Tama. Get Tama. Yeah, I mean, Vivian, she's pretty good into a Tywin sometimes sometimes yeah I don't know so I've seen her being like used around like in other different comps I don't have a use for her really but yeah if you like her she's usable and she has an EE so I mean get that an uphill battle so her side story is getting uh coming out next week be prepared for that guys she can clean up if uh, she gets S2. Oh yeah, two turns. Pretty much she'll give herself greater and then S2 and kill everyone. Yeah. And alongside this side story as well that's coming up is the Mystic Summon rotation. Oh. I know people were wondering what it was going to be, who was it going to be, and it's going to be DJ Basar. So alongside his newly buff and alongside the new Great Chief Kawana, um, is going to be DJ B. I love that great chief Koana video that one of our players made on Reddit. I know what you're talking He's about. The uh, My Hero Academia. Yeah. Yeah, that was that was that was something. That was something, guys. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but yes, moving back to us, guys. Uh, we have a uh, another small thing to note. So on here right now, guys, we're going to be going over some announcements. Uh, first okay. off, first, it is the inventory expansion by 50 slots. Oh, wait, 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 Mashu, before you go on. Mm -hmm. So, guys, like I said, that was a 6 out of 10. 
right here. Seven out of ten. Let's go. But yes, guys, equipment inventory expansion. People are asking for it. They're allowing for more inventory, and this will be at, at the end of the month. Okay. You have to check that out there. Next up on the table. Hold on, let me pull out my sheet real quick. We have the change of energy right here. The energy required for expedition will decrease. So it used to be 16, 18, and 20. Now it's 14, 16, and 18. A small decrease for now, but it's, dude, for no, the no. amount of hunts that people are doing. That's what I'm saying, right? You guys, this may seem small. This may seem small, but it is huge. For those of you who are spamming uh, expos right now, honestly, it just it's it's adding another two or three expos to what you're already doing, honestly. Um, and we'll still be looking into it, guys. So even though the changes are happening, there might be changes in the future. We don't know. But for it's now, really huge to me because I spam expeditions like crazy. Yeah, I know people are spamming it like crazy. That's the only reason why I. I, know. I forget we have a lot of casuals in chat. Okay. But yes, that is how that is for now. Alongside those expedition changes. Now, next up will be the amounts of expedition points acquired will be adjusted from 40, 50, 60 from level 1, 2, and 3. Now, just to 60 points regardless of level. Meaning that even if you guys are, are unable or newer and are unable to do like level 2 or 3 expeditions, you can at least finish the depot. And yeah. But yeah, the, the 60 points is pretty nice for those of you who are doing level 1 expeditions. I don't know what that's like right now, Guys, dude. If there, are, if, if there are you people posting level 1 expeditions, not on my friends list. <laughs> not on my friends list. I'm not going to lie. I had to max min some of my friends list just because of these expo changes. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. Mm -hmm. But yeah, guys, so in the future, you guys will be able to get 60 points no matter what expedition you're doing. So at least it's helpful that way for those people who are unable to do um, the higher level stuff. Mm -hmm. Next up now, it's the total points required will be decreased from 2100 to 2000. The obtainable rewards will remain the same. Mm -hmm. So uh, um, like meaning that we're just lowering the cost of everything and they'll be adjusted alongside. So you'll be able to get the same rewards just at a faster rate for depots. I feel like expeditions are just so worth doing nowadays, though, that mm -hmm. even if you hit that like limit, you're still doing expeditions. Yeah. So even if you hit that limit, you'll be able to get it faster for those who are trying to push for it, though. So for those of you who um, maybe are just like a poster, you know, you just post expeditions, you don't really do them, then mm -hmm. it, it helps those people out, right? And next up, we have probably the biggest thing for expeditions. Starting from April, a total of six greater equipment modification gem selection chests will be given. Two sets per boss. So for now, let me let me go over of how this will work. There's a lot of stuff over here. So each boss will have a different set. So each boss will have two per. And each boss has a different set, for example. The Ferris, Brutal Ferris, gives speed and crit set. The Lich gives attack and health set. The Gigantes gives immune and rage set. If Simakis reappears per rotation in the future, you can get the greater modification gem selection box of destruction and counter set. Meaning that you're able to choose whatever um, like boxes you want from the depot. And this is not like the rewards from the last uh thing will not uh change at all so you always receive those rewards with these rewards on top yeah <laughs> and then, finally if, these are, this is what people are asking for right is uh like the ability oh. because especially when doing so many expos you just want to yeah go ahead new I think people were, you know, expecting the worst of the worst, you know? They yeah. were saying things that, you know, we're probably going to get, like, packs where people have to purchase for greater, like, selection charms or whatever, you know? Or we're, we're going to get, like, a steeple thing where you, like, put yeah. a bunch of useless ones in and you get a random one. This is selection better than what a lot of people may have initially yeah. 
expected. Yeah, so it'll be introduced into the depots in April. And this, these are uh, selection boxes similar to our other selection boxes. You get to choose exactly what it is. Wait, there's someone saying it's not better at all. Wait, how? I'm guessing they wanted the packs. <laughs> oh, God. Please that, 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 that's my guess. Okay. But yes, in addition to that, we have all confirmed the comments that you have given in the last update, such as the first level is difficult, hard to play. We're discussing, uh, discussing plans while reviewing the related date, and we will continuously check the opinions of the game data given by our players so we can improve them in the good direction. Meaning that um, we're always looking at the game data and seeing how you guys play it, um, and also your information coming to us uh, regarding feedbacks and everything else. We're always looking into that, so make sure to always check out like our Discord, push out those suggestions, um, and everything else, you know? Yeah. And guys, that's not even the best part yet. There's something better coming soon. There's, this dude, there's stuff better, all right? You thought that was over. You thought we were done with this Mystic Rotation. Nope, we're still going for more. And what is coming up in April, guys? You guys, we announced the last time. It is the Guilty Gear collaboration wait, wait, wait. return. This is, this is what I meant, by the way. This is not what I meant, because a lot of you guys knew this was coming. But keep, keep Yes, waiting. there's something wait. new. There's something new. There's something new. There's new news. So 331, so after the maintenance, uh, and to 415, we'll be coming here. Soul, Junkyard Dog, 5-star Hero Summon Ticket, and more. So you guys are able to grab Soul, grab Junkyard right. Dog for free, uh, just by um, that stuff. And the Guilty Gear Group Summon. So I know a bunch of people were talking about Guilty Gear Group Summoning. And we're like, hey, it's probably going to be similar to the last one, and it is. So here it is, Biken, Elfelt, and Disney for group summon, similar to the last one. So get your miscon files ready, get your Elfelts ready, get your Elfelts ready, get your Elfelts ready. <clears throat> get your Elfelts ready. On mm -hmm. um, another thing too, we have the balance adjustments preview for Soul and Elfelt. Okay. So both Soul and Elfelds are going to be slightly changed and adjusted. Uh, and yeah, so we will see. We have heard from what you guys have been talking about prior, especially to like when Elfo was first released and people trying her out and everything else. So yeah, we'll see how this will be able to be changed. And I know this is more of like a precedent that people have never been before seen. A collab unit is getting like changed, right? Yeah. Wait, let me go check what Elfelt's rating in game is currently. What's her rating in game, guys? I have no idea. Wait, I have... put so many molas into her though because I play her in Guilty Gear. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Let's see. Her rating is three point four. Three point four. Well, that's gonna go up. That's higher than Briserius though. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> well, Briserius is just a joke nowadays. So, and with that, guys, uh, you guys know how it is. With the group summons, we have the Stars Mirage Coin Shop. So alongside, you have Biken, Elfelt, and Dizzy in the coin shops, and the respective artifacts, I believe. Yeah. And yeah. 5.0 now. I have I a mean, triple S Elfelt. I mean, wait, 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 guys, guys, guys. Let's not jump the shark before... I don't know how that saying goes, but, you know, like... It's hype, but we, we, we let's, 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 let's wait and see. Right? Well, let's wait and see how it is first, and then you guys will be able to see yeah. how everything happens and turns out. But yes, guys, that is it for us. Soul is free if you log in, I believe. Did you guys not see? Did you guys not see this? The login event. Yes, Soul, Junkyard Dog, 5-star Hero Summon Ticket. Y'all get Soul for free. Yes. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. But yeah, guys, that is it from us on our end for the news today. Uh, make sure to do that survey. Make sure to check us out everywhere else to make sure your suggestions are heard. We are listening to everyone, as you know, um, especially with the expedition stuff, right? We're going at, at it slowly because we don't want to change things too drastically. Yeah. Um, I, think, yeah. I think the addition of the greater selectors... That's huge. Though. That's not yes. that, that's huge. My gosh, dude. I can't wait just because like yeah. there's gear that I want to improve already. 
and everyone knows it's like there's that that perfect gear that they want mm -hmm. new out of 10 stream see what i tell you guys beginning kind of kind of slow but some hype dude i'm ready i'm ready i have an elf alt. she's ready to go so we'll see how how it turns out honestly yeah we'll, we'll see how her her balance adjustment yeah people make sure yeah, yeah. you know people when, when talking about the collab talking about that portrait get that portrait good artifact granted symbol of unity is up now so mm -hmm. it's like not as like crazy right but it's still good yeah. yeah guys thank you again for joining us on this late night for those of you like night morning afternoon whatever else guys you know oh yeah it's daylight savings now so we literally stayed up till what 3 a.m yeah yeah it's pretty late on our end i'm not gonna lie guys quite tired so um coming up though we have our thursday stream it's gonna be twitch plays at thomas on tower so honestly yeah you guys will be able to choose my units my my devices my skills everything else i'll even I'll pop my my free equipment removal on that day just so we can move around gear and build whoever you want. Oh, guys, if you all tune in to Thursday's live stream, I'll show you all a hamster. Okay, I'll see you there. Yes. Bye, yeah, guys. Thank you again for joining us, and we will see you next time. Take it easy, y'all. It's your boy, Mashu. Your number one, rank one, legend player, new, friendly, Neighbor, peace. Take it easy. <laughs>